Hello. Well, that was a bit aggressive. Hi. Hi. I'm on a tree. This is my thinking spot, okay? When I need ideas. And guess what? I have an idea. We're at my castle. Hey everyone, welcome back to channel. Today we're back. Blackaborg. Okie dokie, we're back with the castle. It's finally that time of the week. Today, we're working on dungeon. Anybody who misbehaves or commits a crime while living here gets sent to the dungeons, all right? I figured out where that's going to be, obviously. It's, uh, it's right over here by the, uh, you know, the outhouses. So whenever a grand opening is going to happen, you guys have no excuse to be stinky, all right? If you stink, you're first place that you need to go to is this area okay whether it's the toilet or the shower anyway back to the dungeon it's going to be over here but i don't think it's, it's exactly going to be like in this spot i'm going to be um putting a staircase that will lead further down and it's going to be super creepy you're going to be like literally deep down in the dungeon it's going to be like a prison jail obviously but there's gonna be skeleton uh spider webs Creepy spiders, probably even. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be wonderful. And then I'm thinking for the last ever build, which will happen in the next castle video, where I actually build the entire, like, the actual castle building. I'm thinking of doing, like, partially of me, like, speaking and building at the same time, but then I'll do, like, a speed build with a voiceover it. Of course, the tour at the end of that. I'm gonna also be choosing a name in the last episode, too, because, um, yeah, I still need a name for the official castle. So if you have name suggestions, this is your last call for, um, castle names. So leave those down below. All right, let's, before we begin, color code of the day. I, I love this, like, orangey color. A lemon color. That's like bright yellow, isn't it? I don't know if that's an anime or something. Maybe that's just their name. God's Kaiju. Do I feel like a lemon today? Like sour? Do I feel sour? I don't know. 233-231-112. Ah, <laughs> it is very lemony. Thank you for the color code. I appreciate it. It's wonderful. Okay. All right. Okay. So you know how our like actual hill has like lots of layers to it? Yeah, I'm thinking it goes down here because we do have a lot of empty space down here, but there's no point. You know, sometimes it's just we leave the empty space as an empty space. We don't have to fill up everything, but this is perfect for a dungeon. Let's redo this first of all. All right. We got to make it cryptic. Let's do something as simple as this. Okay. Actually, no. Okay. And then we must have a stair. Oh my God. It's so bright. It's so bright. My eyes, my eyes. I can't even, I can't even read the, the words sometimes. Yeah, that's fine. We'll do that. We'll just put it there. And then let's have the floor. Oh my gosh. It's so, it's so dark down here. It's so dark. That's the point of it though. It's gotta be dark. It's gotta be creepy, eerie. It could be a dungeon keeper. Someone could literally just like, it could actually just be in charge of you know, watching over the criminals. We'll do also have like another side of cells over here too. Just a bunch of three by threes as always. Nothing more, nothing. Well, actually it should be less. There you go. It's going to be like this. Ooh, creepy. <laughs> creepy. I'm going to floor this. There's currently eight cells. Did I have a few more? You know what? Let's keep going. Let's do one right there. And then maybe curve. And then there'll be more cells back here. You know, this is a pretty big dungeon. Yeah, that'll be fun. Okay, and then it'll just end off there. I don't want it too crazy. Of course, you know, it'll look better with all the detailing and such. So I want to do like a couple more like smaller dungeons over here. We'll just do, we'll do two more dungeons here. These are like the smaller ones. If you've done like a, a very terrible crime, you'll just go into these smaller ones. Um, there'll be some dead space. Like this is dead space. Nothing will be, you know, there'll be no use out of this, but I guess I'll just keep it. They call them the maximum security sliding door. Oh, do I use that one or use this one? It doesn't matter. Yeah, we'll just go ahead and copy these over. It's a very simple build today, but oh my gosh, that looks very, very creepy. You know, very creepy. Okay, now we can place this. And we'll place a couple more. I love it so far. Oh, there's grass over here. My bad. <laughs> my bad. Oh, let me put a wall down here and then like this. You know, put a little arch there. Cool. Ooh, ooh, that gives it, that gives it something. I don't know. So yeah, it's gonna look, it's gonna have this vibe here. Um, maybe out of brick. Maybe brick. Brick is good. I don't know how to light up. Wait, 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 wait. No, the wall torches for it. And more torches on the sides, like so. Gotta make it creepy. Gotta make it super creepy. Like, it'll, instead of it being flat, like the, the doors are like flat on the wall like this. I think these pillars help create some sort of shape to it. Some depth. I don't know. I just think the cells by themselves are like boring to have. So we gotta, we gotta decorate them in a bit. A little bit too dark. I want to have like some very warm, like this is super warm lighting. Okay. Super warm. I call this the super warm light. 
I think we need some like crates and um, barrels down here too, for sure. Like I could imagine that. Yeah, that's that's a thing. And then we just make it out of. Uh, we don't make it out of stone. It has to be out of wood. Okay, that looks fine. We'll just do that. Okay. Um, I need actual. I need skeletons. I need some skeletons. I don't know about that. Bones? Ew! I hate this. If you're arachnophobic, I don't think you should be down here. If you hate spiders, this is not the place for you. Okay, hold on. I need to light up this little area too. I don't know what this is. Should I make this dead space? Yeah, I think I'm just gonna close this off. I don't know what that will be. I'm getting Minecraft flashbacks. I'm like, I need to light up this area so creepers don't spawn, but we're not playing Minecraft. We are not. Great, skeleton spiders. Oh, I need those. Uh, I need blood pile. Blood, blood, blood thingies. <laughs> I mean, um, fruit punch. I need fruit punch. Blood. <laughs> okay. Maybe some of the cells can like have blood coming out of it and then just like empty, whatever. This is what you get for being a prisoner, you know? This is what happens when you are a prisoner down here. Maybe I'd have some like dirt piles in here too, just like dirt piles. Because it's not clean down here, it's not supposed to be clean. I mean, it definitely adds something, but I don't know if it's like that good. I need to see some sunlight real quick, hold on. I've been down in the dungeon for too long, I need to, I need to, I need to uh, sniff the fresh air. <laughs> As if I'm actually there. I need to see the sunlight a bit. Okay, back to the dungeon, guys. Back to the dungeon. Um, I honestly don't even know what to do with this room. Do I put like a desk down here or something? Oh, there should be cameras, but this is medieval. There should not be cameras. Watcher, the dungeon sitter. Maybe this could be like another cell, you know, that they could literally just be exclusively watching over. Yeah, there, there doesn't need to be a torch. Oh, oh my gosh. I, I just realized I need to put um, I put some walls over these so people don't climb over the cells. One moment. <laughs> so they don't climb over into each other's cells. That would be terrible. I gotta, I gotta make sure no one can climb through. Gotta make it impossible. Okay, we gotta make it impossible for fights to happen. Go ahead and choose some beds for them. Let's just give them the standard bed and then make it like rusty looking. They don't deserve good treatment. Like they don't even deserve a bed, but you know what? It's fine. We'll be sleeping on metal too, by the way. Their pillows will be made out of metal as well. Just copy and paste all these beds. That's all you get though. That's all you get. Maybe a desk yourself. When will you learn your actions have consequences? When will you learn your actions have consequences? Is this too luxurious? This is too luxurious. Oh, maybe some vines. Vines would look really good down here. So that in between like each pillar, you know, just gives it more detail like these are like very old dungeons and growth is going to happen down here somehow like some overgrowth of some sort <laughs> oh you can put them on like actual regular pillars wow that's kind of cool that looks like a jungle i'm doing too much let's just put some like stone or something down here i don't know we might as well as well add some wall trimming of some sort there's no excuse to make it like ugly ugly but oh wait i forgot there's supposed to be more cells over here too okay wait no, these guys don't get toilets. They have to poop in there. <laughs> they gotta poop in their, their cells. Sorry, you don't got a toilet. They'll never see the sunlight ever again. I really like it though. This is good. It's very, it's still simple to me, but it's still, I think it looks pretty. It reminds me of like, um, you know, those older games, those dungeons from the game. I think we need more webs, more webs. More spider webs and such. I only have two webs left. What am I gonna do with this? No, no, I'm just gonna put them randomly. A family of spiders have taken over down here. They've taken um, shelter down here. So you don't wanna be down here. You truly don't. I think I'm done. This is all I need. Okay, and if I ever want to do more detailing in a way, then I could, but I think this is a good dungeon. I think this is a, a a passable dungeon, if I must say. I forgot to put the pillars on this side too. I thought I had skulls. Are there like, oh wait, there are skulls. Hold on, skulls. Okay, there you go. This is more like it. I need this. I need this, just like skulls. Oh yeah, and then the skulls could be near the spiders as if the spiders ate those people, that, these skulls. It's a little, a little gruesome. It's a little bit gruesome, but whatever. Maybe a little, a little Christmas candle down here. <laughs> little Christmas candle. No worries. Okay, is there anything else that I want to add down here? Oh, graves, gravestones. I don't know if gravestones would fit down here. Now it just looks like a prop house. I don't want to add ghosts. It will look too Halloween-y. There's nothing else for me to add. I think I'm good. This is it. All right, let's go ahead and I don't know what to do here. We'll see. Maybe I'll do something around here, but I think I'm good now. We're good. Let's go ahead and take a look at our new dungeon, guys. Oh, I'm a bit depressed. Do 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 do. Let's take a look, guys. I finished with my dungeon. Are you guys ready? You've already seen it. You've already seen me building it. I'm like, why are you guys? The main area, we're taking you down to your cell. And then, boom. 
the actual dungeons, guys. I think it looks really good. As always, you could I could always do even more with it. Like, just keep going further. Like, there's always more you can probably do with places like these. But for now, I think this is actually a decent um, dungeon. It's a decent prison. Um, hopefully, it intimidates them, you know? Hopefully, it intimidates you. You got plenty of cells. Plenty of room for many cr people who do crimes around here. So we'll never run out of space. Um, yeah, we're prepared. We are prepared as well. Of course, when you walk in. Yep, this is your space. Maybe I should put like some mold or something. I don't know. Maybe I should make some more details inside the actual cells. But now it's just a simple clean look. Hey guys, that will wrap up today's video. If you guys enjoyed it, you found it inspiring in a way, make sure to give it a big old thumbs up. And make sure you hit the subscribe button too because it is completely free. Thank you all for taking the time every day to watch this. And I will talk to you all in the next video. Have a great day. Pita Bread signing out. Goodbye, everybody. You better be careful, guys. You don't want to end up down here. This is a very dark, creepy, eerie place. It stinks. And um, you won't be happy and you will never see the sunlight ever again.